know, it's maybe no coincidence that Enda Walsh chose to direct this particular opera, and it's the first opera he directs outside his own work, outside his own writing. I mean, I worked with him on The Last Hotel, which was a wonderful experience, which he had scripted himself, and of course it was a new composition by Donneke Dennehy, but they worked very closely together. So for me it was really interesting to see what's the first piece Ender would show, choose uh, to direct that's not his own. And as I say, maybe not a coincidence, he chose this piece, a very taut piece. It's like a chamber play of only one hour's length and only two people on stage, although we have more people on stage, but these two, uh, these, these two are talking to each other. And when I say talking to each other, I actually mean literally because it's an opera that is not very operatic in the sense that it has a lot of arias. Uh, in fact, it has almost no arias as such, but a lot of conversation, a lot of rec recitativo, um, where really also they follow the, the vocal lines follow the speaking line lines and the rhythm of the language, the Hungarian language, is so musical and is, is really part of the score, like Bartok composed uh, the vocal lines after the rhythm of, and the speech melody sometimes even, of the Hungarian language. So it is like a piece of theatre with music.